you know what I thought was really funny when I was a little kid? I'll tell you. The song, Venus, if you will, pre-send me a girl for me to thrill. I changed the word Venus to penis. Yeah, I bet you did. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions, you idiots. This is the kind of content you get here. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter, or two C. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> you know the rest. Yeah. Uh, you know the drill. Uh, today we're acting to a trailer Good. of an old Amir Khan film. Hey! Uh, we just watched a movie by him. We watched a movie of him. And I'm sorry to say he's not on social media anymore. Did you see that? Yeah. What's all that about, it's Amir? Probably, it's probably because I called this film a masala film. That's probably it. He just, <laughs> he's like, I'm done. He was right at the edge. Right at the edge, and then he saw you, uh, and he's like, I'm done with social Corbin media. Corbin called Talasha a masala film. Yeah. Ah, oh, darn it. How dare he. Uh, this is uh, er, called Earth. Uh, with Amir Khan, uh, Nandita Das, Deepa Mehta, and, then, and music by A.R. Roman. Yes. A beautiful Hindu... Hindu? Let's start the sentence over. A beautiful Hindu woman who works as a nanny finds herself caught between the affections of two Muslim men while also dealing with the devastating consequences of the partition. The yeah, I think, I thought this was called, maybe it's just called Earth, but I thought it was called 1947 Earth. Which obviously would, you know, that would make more sense. Yeah, but yeah, Earth in and of itself makes me think of like I'm going to see a music video with Michael Jackson talking about saving the planet. Yeah, um, so I don't know what the actual, but it's in this trailer. But I don't know if it's real because it's 1998, so this could yeah. just be a fan made trailer. But right. in terms of when we talk about what's the next American, I hear this one. I hear it starts with like an S. I think it's with him and Nasser and Shaw. I think we reacted to a song from it before. I don't know. Uh, a, a while back. But uh, let us know what's the next. And I'm assuming you guys would know. If you have never American seen Con. Michael's video and his song, Earth Song, I, I was pretty sure everyone on the planet has seen that. But if you haven't, you should what check it out. What have we done to the world? Yeah, he, he knew what was going on and Look talking about it before a lot of people. Done. I sing just like him. Here we go. We get a narration. In the time that land forgot. At the close of the midnight hour, when the world sleeps, India will awake to life and freedom. Is it in English? Uh, well, that's what I was just gonna ask. Yours is dubbed. Interesting. Looks good. Yeah, I gotta say, when it first started, I thought we were gonna get a, a trailer that had no real connection point. Yeah, no. And I was gonna end going, okay, I really don't know anything about it. But, like, midway through, it turned into yeah, really nice, didn't so it? It looks like, um... One, is it in English, or was that just dubbed for, for the... It looked... I, did, I was watching their lips. They were... That didn't look dubbed. It looked English? Yeah, but I don't know how much of it is in English. And clearly it made the festival, because when you get the Boston Globe and Variety talking about it, that's, that's because it's made it to something like the Cannes Film Festival or 
Sundance or Toronto or any number of ones that are internationally acclaimed. It's 1947 and the border lines between India and Pakistan are being drawn. A young girl witnesses tragedy as her Aya nanny is caught between the love of two men and the rising tide of political and religious violence. Ooh. Yeah, the premise sounds painful. Yeah, that, anytime you talk about- Look about, at the runtime. 1998, it's not even two hours. Why does this, why does Deepa Mehta sound familiar to me? Because we've seen, we've seen that name for a long time in Deepa many, Mehta. many things. Deepa Mehta. Yeah, that's a, that's a long standing name in a lot of things. Why do I know that name? Trying to see if we've seen something with her. Deepa Mehta. I think I also heard this as part of like, almost like a trilogy. Because I think there's something called there's fire, mm -hmm. and then, there, and I think there's water. Water, and yeah, yeah, water, and I think that water's with I think John Abraham on Yara Kashyap wrote water. Mm. Uh, yeah, unless I'm wrong, and it's not John Abraham. Maybe that's it. No, it's John Abraham. Okay, so I don't know if those are related to it as well, but it looks good. It looks really good. Like in terms of like, it looks like a, it's probably going to be a powerful story, which we know Amir Khan likes to do. Yeah, he likes to do stories that actually have like a deep message to them. Right, but this one looks different than say because even there was a frivolity and a lightheartedness to the majority of Three Idiots and mm -hmm. PK, mm -hmm. but um, but they still big messages. Big big messages. Yeah. This one on this one looks like it's more. Um, dramatic, grounded, like the kind of film you, you're watching and talking about during awards season. Yeah. Right? Absolutely. Yeah, this looks really good. And with the subject, I don't think we've... Have we reacted to... I mean, have we seen any film that actually dealt with the partition? Yeah. Um, what was it? Outside, like, directly the partition. Not, like, the side effects, like the classic Bengali one we we did which was like the aftermath of it. Yeah. Which, no. Uh, but, like, I'm the, talking like the... The, the murders that happened, no. the death that happened, the no, train I mean, loads the, of dead bodies. I'm thinking about the only Salman Khan film we saw, which was about oh, yeah. getting across that. But yeah, it no, was no. about getting across the border. It wasn't about no, not the, the partition. time of partition. Which, no, you know what comes to mind hmm. is that commercial we saw. Remember, a year and a half ago at least, it was the commercial connecting old friends who hadn't seen each oh, other yeah. since childhood yeah. when the partition happened. That was beautiful. But no, I, I think we haven't seen a film that specifically is happening during partition and what it My did to My wife people. has read one of the books that we've, we got about, uh, from a stupid baby about the partition. Book, yeah. Which by the way, we have a new PO box. Oh yeah, we uh, do. I, 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 it's in the description. It's been a long time since we've had that updated. So because it was moved and the, the other one wasn't close anymore. So we had to cancel yeah. it. Um, but anyways, yeah. But yeah, uh, so you can, the, we can have a mail opening again in the next month or two probably. One of the uh, books that we got, she's, she's read, it's, it's it's gory and and just awful, almost like Holocaust level yeah, yeah, of yeah. what what happened during the partition to families and to people. people. It was it's terrible. Some of the stories that she she told me about. It was, yeah, it's incredibly sad. So I can imagine um, one love Amir Khan. Obviously, yeah. yeah. This looks like a very dramatic performance for him. Yeah. So, uh, uh, how's this film? Should this be the next Amir Khan film we watch? I know there's others that people. I think one starts with an S that a lot of people. Uh, hold on, let me try to find the name here. Mm. Starts with an S, and then I will get to it. Do do do. Isn't it funny how the brain works? Yep. That you do. You'll remember specifically. It's got this letter in it. This. Sarfarosh. 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 Uh, as well. And then, oh, he produced Pepe Live, which, remember we, remember oh, Pepe Live? I think we, I think Does it that even matter? Of all the things on here on his resume, you know it's Doom 3. Yeah, of course. That will definitely be the next one we watch. Let us know down below. Ha ha ha